Hello everyone. Uh, I'm trying to introduce my idea for my new business. This is a small startup and I'm Milena Tukic. Um, being a biomedical engineer of electronics and with a PhD in biophysics and neuroscience, I somehow got the idea how we can merge uh, several disciplines in, in uh, those two fields. So, uh, by having practice with research with uh, different kinds of electromagnetic stimulation of brain, like transcranial magnetic stimulation, transcranial dialect stimulation, uh, direct electrical stimulation, um, and some methods of analysis, I understood that uh, although this is very often the subject of research and interest of many researchers in neuroscience, uh, you can only find it in publication only rarely in application and clinical practice. So, when you look from the engineering point of view, every EEG apparatus, which is extensively used for uh, strong, making stronger the diagnostics in uh, uh, neurology or uh, neuropsychiatry, has only application on Fourier's transform and its derivatives. Uh, all the softwares usually use only that kind of analysis and clinicians are used to it because they are using it for years. But nonlinear analysis, which is not new, we are using it more than 30 years, years very successfully, when you combine it with data mining and uh, machine learning, can give us some methods which are user-friendly. And uh, I came to an idea uh, to offer to clinicians something which is very accurate, uh, which can be calculated in real time and can stronger, uh, can make stronger their differential diagnosis when they are trying to determine whether someone has bipolar disorder or unipolar depression, or when, when they, are, they are not sure whether it is safe to change the medication to their patient who is suffering from, from depression but they are not sure whether it is still in exacerbation or in remission. The method we applied can clearly uh, classify that. And uh, uh, some months ago, we clearly show that any method of machine learning applied are giving quite big accuracy on that task. Also, the idea of this small company is to introduce um, an early prediction Parkinsonism, which is also based on the extensive use of nonlinear measures in characterizing that signal, which could become a very low cost method for early prediction, and many people would benefit from that. So, uh, with many facets of this project of uh, application in clinical practice, uh, uh, is my next task.